Nagaland State Agricultural and Livestock Marketing Board Laga Initiative under the Cooperative Society Logode Miligina Kukha Kulu Agri Pra Local Mass Bikabule Karni Business Shru Krishi Local Fish or Frozen Meat Kiosk Agri Expo Fort Mile De Into Laga Business To NSBM Chairman T. Inavi Jimo Pra Chief Executive Officer G. Ikuto Jimo Mi Laga Age Pra Inaugurate Kredishi Thank you so much for joining Hornbill TV again to give us more insight into this uh, opening of this store. So, so how is this uh, particular uh, store where we are going to uh, store fishes? How is this going to benefit us, in uh, the Nagas in general? Well, uh, thank you Hornbill TV. Mm, actually, as per the Act 2005, it was supposed to be agricultural produce only. But after the Act of uh, 2000, 22, uh, it was uh, decided that it should be agriculture, produce, and livestock marketing. So, but till uh, 2020, it was agriculture produce. And uh, after this act, we have decided it to be livestock marketing. So this is the first of its kind. Bringing it, we already have SC agri, agri produce uh, SC market there, and in the adjoining area, we now have livestock marketing too. So we provide uh, local fish, fresh fish, uh, without those uh, chemicals and uh, formal hide, and we have also frozen meat here. Most of the time, we'll be providing local uh, meat from the farmers and uh, local entrepreneurs. So, so how, how do they go about, you know, like people wanting to actually invest here, the, the fish farmers as well, how do they go about with this? Sir? Or is it just for the consumers, this particular uh, livestock market? Is it going to be only helpful for the consumers or even uh, the people, the, especially the fish farmers, local fish farmers, if they want to also join, how do they go about most of our people, we tend to like uh, buy the fishes that comes from outside. But now that we have a fish kiosk here, we will encourage the local uh, entrepreneurs, not only entrepreneurs, but even the uh, farmers to bring in their fishes here. So it is like outsourcing and encouraging the, not only the entrepreneurs, but also the people in the uh, the, 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 the farmers. So I think that way it will help uh, people a lot in both ways. Both to the, con not only to the consum consumers. Because the consumers, they are at the mercy of the uh, other states. And also, you know, people that uh, neighboring states like Assam and all. But you don't really have to depend on them anymore. Because we have uh, fresh fish here anytime. So the consumer can always, are always welcome. And instead of depending on others, we can have our own local products here. That's for the consumers. And besides that, we encourage also and we also help uh, the local entrepreneurs to uh, sell their uh, the, the, fishes and uh, meats here. And uh, even the far farmers now can always, uh, sometimes they find a problem to sell their goods or their produce. But they can always bring it here. They are welcome here. We can always buy it. Thank you so much, uh, sir, for speaking to us. And we believe it will be beneficial for uh, especially uh, us Nagas in general. Thank you so much. Mm. Yeah. For now, this is all. I'm reporter Kirkristin Yukewo. We camera person Ketholeno for Hornbill TV.